At about 1am on Wednesday morning, the 1st of August, the Coast Guard station at Fife Ness, near Crail in the East Nuke of Fife, received a Mayday distress call from the motor vessel Princess. There was some difficulty in locating the position of the vessel, which reported it had struck rocks and was sinking. The first reported position was St Andrews Bay. The Anstruther lifeboat station was asked to launch both lifeboats. They're seen here entering Crail Harbour. The RNLI crew could not locate the casualty and the vessel was asked to confirm its position. The next reported position was near the Car Rock. The Coast Guard requested the vessel to fire flares. Visitors to the Soho caravan site, woken by cries for help, spotted the flares and made a 999 emergency call to the Coast Guard. Despite poor visibility and shallow rough seas, the inshore boat recovered the two crewmen from the stranded vessel and returned them to the all-weather lifeboat which was standing offshore. The survivors were landed safely at Anstruther Harbour. Next morning, environmental maintenance contractors removed the fuel from the vessel, which appeared to be unsalvageable. Ironically, the motor vessel Princess was a converted lifeboat.